So a friend of mine, thank you, Peck, called me this morning or texted me and said, hey, turn on the Today Show because they're talking about intuitive eating. And boy, did I race to the television and turn that thing on. And they were. And it was, I agreed with a lot of what they said. But of course, it was still a little rulesy the way they were talking. And one thing that really is not true is they, they, don't, they don't allow you to think of intuitive eating as a way to lose weight. And that's such a shame. That's so stupid. That bugs me so much. Because then if you want to lose weight, you think you can't be an intuitive eater. I'm telling you guys, my friends out there, you guys who want to lose weight, you can do it eating intuitively. And I'm going to get hate and people saying it's not for weight loss. It depends upon how you use it. I, I respect my body and I want you to respect your body too. And when you respect your body and you want to be at a lower weight, which is your choice, I'm not telling anyone to lose weight, it's your choice, then you figure out, okay, how am I going to do that? Well, I don't want you to go on a diet. I want you, because I've been there, done that, and it's amazing, to use intuitive eating for weight loss. And the way you do that is you, you get comfortable with hunger. And hold on, I don't mean that you walk around hungry. I don't mean that. But you stop fearing it. You start using it as a tool, as guidance. And when in your heart and soul you know that as soon as you get to that hunger point where you just really want to eat and you're going to get sad if you don't, you eat but you learn to tolerate hunger for periods of time. And it's not negative. Look at me, it's not negative, it's not scary, it's not bad, it's delightful. Think of other physical things that you look forward to and the anticipation of, you know, the enjoyment of that is also very nice. It's just like that, guys, it's just like that. So, you know, get, get intuitive eating as just a way to maintain your weight you can and you, you can just use intuitive eating just to have a better body image and all that stuff is good. And, but if you want to lose weight, don't, don't run away from intuitive eating like I'll lose weight and then I'll be an intuitive eater because that doesn't work. Because once you lose weight on a diet, there's, you rebound weight gain. And if you say, oh no, I don't, well, yes, you do. Because look at your history, look at the people around you. Dieting is weight loss frequently. Oh, you see you lose weight, but then you gain it back. So I'm happy they have, they did a thing about intuitive eating and they're saying it's you know becoming more and more popular. Good. Now, use it to be happier around food and eating and to get to your happy weight and stay there. And don't let people tell you that intuitive eating isn't for weight loss. Well, maybe not for you, but I'm telling you it works and it's delightful.